Hello, it's part 42 of a Plague Tale Requiem. Josh isn't here, is he? This big, big lummox would move. Well, I'd like to help, but first I must know what you're searching for. All right. So it's uh, it's a bit strange, but well, go on, Hugo. Yes. In my dream, I woke up on the beach, and I was sick and scared. But a big bird came, and I followed him. I thought I was dying. But the bird showed me water that healed me. And there was a huge tree, too. And that's where I wake up each time. Good. So, bird, tree, and water. Could be anywhere. But I guess it's a start. We can ask at the market. Come on. There we go. Yeah, there we go. Finally. Move your big fucking lummox. Is there anyone else that I can speak to? Well, you, I can speak to you. Hello. Hello there. Would you know of a beach where we could find special birds? <laughs> this is an island, so the birds are mostly seagulls. Not a bird much dreamed of, like Wager. <laughs> They're bloody thieves, I tell you. It's not a seagull. Let's go. Hey, thank you, sir. May your day be bright. Yours too. Manners. Nothing. <laughs> well, he knows about seagulls. Be patient, Hugo. Hello, sir. Hello. What can I do for you? Need any spices? Maybe later. We've been told of a pond of water with healing properties. Do you know where it is? Not a clue. But there are many ways to be blessed during the brighter days. Oh, good to know. Is there a big bird on this island? <laughs> There's a few here and there. Maybe you'll see them. Well, thank you for your time. You're welcome. No pond. Maybe birds. <laughs> yes. 
this year's festival feels busier than usual. <laughs> Good time to shift out. Twice as many stands as the last one. Can I go down this way? Come see her. Go on. Don't be afraid. What's she called? Lucinda. You're nice, don't you, Cinder? She loves you. Really? That's I love you in goat. <laughs> you alright? She screamed at me. That's called bleating. It's how they talk. She's a goat, you know. disorientate an enemy. <laughs> Can't wait to hear you bleat into battle. <laughs> Next time, maybe. Did you know goats don't have front teeth? Just like some of my men. There must be someone else. All right, let's try and ask someone here. Good work with the decorations, everyone. Oh, and if you still want to help, we need a hand with tonight's feast. Good afternoon. Hello, we've just arrived and we heard about a beach with a pond not too far. Hmm. That's very specific. Anyone? Sorry, I really don't know. Me neither. There's also a big tree. <laughs> well, we have lots of big trees. You'll find some up on the plateau. Thank you anyway. Of course. Why don't they know? Dreams are tales of the soul next week. Not of this world. We'll ask again. Yeah, I think this game is just definitely twice as twice as long as the original because my first my first playthrough was 48 parts. I'm nearly there now, and I think I'm only about halfway through the game. Through the reef, Can okay. Can we play? Sure, it's simple. Throw a pot through each crowd. It's over when you're out of pots. Never shoot twice at the same crowd. Understand? Fine, let's see how I do. You'll I'll win. judge you harshly if you don't. Please, I'm trying to focus. Yes, <laughs> yes. <laughs> I'm so proud of you. Oh no. Good start. Yes, keep going. Slaughter them crowds. Impressive indeed. Astonishing work. May this be the sign of a blessing. Thank you. Oh, oh sweet, that was a goal. Those crowns didn't stand a chance. <laughs> Give me my crown. Let's go see the rest. Well, oh, all right. I thought I gained one like a little Easter egg. Anyway, thank you for watching part forty-two, and I'll see you in part forty-three.